Hey, 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 Captain Johnson, I'm late. Really late. I know Marty's coming on in 20 minutes, so I want to get this going, get it, get it done. I know Red Redford did a live. I missed his live. I did watch it. Red, great live. Uh, shooting out some prayers today for uh, my brothers in the United Kingdom. They got pounded with 90 mile an hour winds. They had a record of 120 mile an hour gust. I actually posted a video uh, that Bill Musk just sent me about just people getting blown over. So a lot of bad storms everywhere. We got pounded last night with, about, I don't know, seven, eight, nine inches. And before it hit, it rained and froze. So it made it pretty deadly. Almost actually got in a little fender bender yesterday. Uh, hit my brakes and slid 30 feet. The good Lord was watching. I stopped this close to the car in front of me. I'm like, whoo, that's all I need is an accident. <laughs> So <laughs> my daughter's laughing at me. So I'm going to do this live. Then Marty's coming on at 2 o'clock to do his live. We're all, I think even Red was an hour late today. We're all a little late. And then I got to get out shoveling, shoveling, shoveling snow. So I'm ready for it. Uh, last night we had an excellent, excellent, excellent webinar. Uh, Robin, myself, Marty DeGarmo talking about the possibilities. I don't call them possibilities. I call them, yeah, that's going to happen with Academy. It was one of the best webinars I've seen. I mean, they're all good webinars, but this one inspired a lot of people and I, it let them understand what Academy was going to do. I mean, courses, anything you want. So I was really, really impressed with that. I wasn't sure how it was going to go, but it actually turned out phenomenal. Um, jumping back to prayers, I also want to shout out to uh, some prayers for Viviana Rodriguez, Susie McRae, Robin Noble, uh, all taking care of their parents right now, and it's not an easy task. I know, Vivi L listen, Viviana got on there last night, and it was something I wanted to touch base on, and she got it out about getting a, uh, you know, she can't wait for a bless, because how much it cost to have someone help you take care of your parents to keep them at home, not put them in a home. Sometimes you have to put them in there. It's, it's, it, was, it was my... I didn't have an option. I, I wasn't going to do it. I promised my mom. But Viviana's, I, I believe she said her parents are both 87 years old. Two people. You could see the wear. You could see the stress. And it's horrible. She wanted to reach out to people of getting something going with OBLES so that we can be able to get an OBLES going to help people keep their parents at home uh, and great care. I know my mom's, man, how much was grandma's a month? Four? A month? Four? Six or seven thousand dollars we were paying a month just to have people come in and watch my mom. It was, it's very, very expensive, guys. So Viviana wants to put something together with a bless. Uh, and, and let's see if we can change that. Okay? We can change that. Me, myself, I don't want to go in a home as I get older. Um, I'd rather you stick me on a, a log and push me out to sea, to be honest with you. Uh, it's very stressful. You want your parents to be as comfortable as they can. And a lot of them aren't comfortable when they go to these uh, senior homes. Some are. My, my grandfather was in one for a couple weeks. He actually liked it. But uh, shout out to Viviana uh, for talking about this last night. It's one of those uh, OBLES missions that we're going to help build up with her. And anyone that wants to get involved with that, uh, contact Viviana Rodriguez or you can contact me. And I'll get you your get uh, your name to her, and I think it's a pretty amazing thing. That's the greatest thing about a passive right now, guys. People are coming out with things that they've always wanted to do or they can't do because they didn't have the funding. That's one of those important things right there. You all know the angels are shooting out for the homelessness project when we launch, but this is another thing that's very important. You know, helping people. The healthcare is not cheap. We all know that. Taking care of people is not cheap, and we want to take care of them. That's that's pretty. Thank God I got a daughter from heaven. Yep, she's sticking her tongue out me, who helped me immensely. Without her, I don't know what I would have done. So, but keep that in mind. Reach out to uh, Viviana Rodriguez, the one that actually gave me this hat, and and help her out. We could we could build that strong, and help a lot of people out. I also want to shoot out some prayers for. Uh, uh, Robin had texted me early this morning that um, Simone is not feeling well. Possibility COVID, not sure. 
I'd reach out to Rob and her sister and her mom. Uh, they're quarantined in, in, in their condo, and it's not good. So say, say some prayers for those guys, guys. So let me say some hi to a few people here because I'm getting crazy. And Red made a comment today on his live that I thought was very interesting. A lot of people are saying, hey, man, why don't you just say what you have to say instead of shouting out to everybody? And uh, I've talked to Bill Must about this. It takes a little time to do it, but we want to show the founders, and I agree with Red 100%, and Marty DeGarma, we want to show the founders we want you part of this. So we're going to shout you out. Sometimes I miss people's names because it jumps all over the place, and uh, it's hard to see it, but I always try to get you in the comments. So let me do that real quick. I don't get a... You know, I don't get a lot of people. Sometimes I'm lucky because those guys get a couple hundred people. I get, you know, 30, 40 people, 50 sometimes. All right, let's see. Liz Leary, how you doing? Hey, uh, woo, those wins were bad, Liz. I seen you guys talking about that to Fat Matta and Bill. So, Tobias John, how you doing? Sam Pat Patel, what's happening? Tanya Passive, hello, Chris, she says. Uh... Tanya is all over the board. Zoltan Bull, what's happening? Uh, Has, oh boy. Hasnane, Corshed, how you doing? Uh, rock on, Tobias, rock on. Randy Johnson, God, I love that last name. I don't know why. How you doing? Yeah, we're looking for that Opalesse. Oh That's going to be a big thing. Ron, I will talk about that. I'll talk about it now since you brought it up. Ron Albert, Lynn Nakamoto will be doing at 8 o'clock. Uh, Ron just, I think, just posted that. Well, we will post it. We'll, we'll have that posted in the back office. I'm not sure if it's going to be a private. Oh, Mike. Engineer Mike's going to be doing the uh, domain, uh, domain name. That should be a good one. But uh, Bob Tukey, Oliver Fonte, Lynn Knock, Ron, it, it's going to be a good one. 8 o'clock tonight. I will share that everywhere. Julie Wen, good morning. How you doing? I know you're in sunny California. <laughs> Pat Parent. There's another rock star. Uh, loving your lives, Pat. Keep doing them. Keep talking to the world. John White, how you doing? Hey, John, what am I, chopped liver? You're talking only to the girl that doesn't say her asses, man. <laughs> Julie, my Amanda, Julie says she loves you. What do you got to say? And? <laughs> my daughter, she's a comic. Ah, uh, we love you, Julie. You know that. Mr. T, what's happening? You're right, Lister. Family is so important. Omid Rizal, how you doing? Uh, James, um, W-A-I-Y-A. Waya, if I said that correct, I hope. Uh, who am I missing? Shaman, how you doing, Shaw? What's happening? Uh, Peter, sure. I just was on the phone with you, Pete. Where's Bill Must? William DeLorme, the Marshmallow Man. How you doing, brother? Keep fighting that fight, William. All right, I think I got Avik. I don't know where Bill is. Love you, John, too, brother. All right, I will get back to you. I don't see my brother Bill. I was just on the phone. Did I ever say hi to you? Bill Must, I know you're there. Get those fingers going for the YouTube. I got to shovel snow. I got to get going. Marty's going to be on in 13 minutes. He always draws a uh, a real big crowd. Uh, Marty just knows how to talk to people a lot better than I can. He looks, He's a real good explainer. So I'm looking forward to that. But, guys... Oh, Academy, uh, we di I did share that live on Bill Must's YouTube channel last night. Scroll down a few, you'll see it. It's, uh, it's pretty amazing. You wouldn't believe the people that have ideas or things they want to teach uh, through Academy, which you don't realize this. A lot of people said, why would I do that? Well, number one, you're going to earn a residual income as a founder. That's, that's the first big one. Number two, you're going to be able to teach a course that maybe you've always wanted to teach. We'll use Bill Muscle Bill, with making guitars. John White, as far as I know, John Ray is going to teach you how to write a book in his wise wisdom. Julie Wen wants to sing. I mean, it's the, the possibilities are endless. And when you hear these people talk about what they want to do, and a lot of it is giving. I know Polly Cherry was speaking last night. Now, I know Polly Cherry and many of you have given your whole life helping people out. That was one of the things she wanted to teach people, how to organize how to get things going, how to help people. It's a wonderful, wonderful thing. So, And many coaches. Uh, I know Julie Wen's doing Saturday on churches, pastors. Hey, man, you have no idea. No, no idea. Imagine streamlining 
your services every Sunday or Saturday whenever you have them on Academy. Okay? Getting out to people that can't leave their homes. The elderly that are sick, maybe they're scared to come out because of the virus. It's huge. All right? And and I don't think the churches are going to charge people for that. But people that have courses, they might charge you five bucks. It might cost four or five hundred dollars or a thousand dollars to actually take these courses somewhere else. My God, what a bargain. And that money goes to you, the person that created that from to all over the world. So just imagine if you charge five bucks to say to, uh, to build a guitar. There's a lot of people out there that love doing that kind of stuff where it would cost thousands of dollars to actually learn how to build a guitar. Now you got this all over the world. Hey, let's say 10,000 people, 10,000 people decide, hey, I want to learn how to build a guitar. And they and they get charged $5 to go to Bill Musk's course. Do the math, folks. Add it up. Oh, my eyeballs. Add it up. That's how powerful a passive is. So not only are you going to earn a residual income, which is the real big one, but now you get to teach your passion to the world. Pretty amazing stuff. All right, did I see Bill Musk on here? Where's Bill Musk, Pete? He's fired. Tiana from Hawaii, how you doing? I hope you're doing great. Steven Robertson, Juanita Michael, uh, Tracy Gear, there you are. There's Bill Must. Get that YouTube going, Bill. <laughs> Kim Mills, how you doing? Kevin Rutledge, hey, hey, hey. Tell Pammy I said hi, Kevin. Hope you guys are having fun. Ah, uh, Liz Leary, I love that name. Liz, is that a cool name, Liz Leary? Uh, yep, we're sitting, we're praying for you. Uh, Simone from Julie. Uh, Newper, how you doing? Uh, Sherry Dursaway, there you go. Wow, you're getting good. How come I'm always late on yours and you get on mine right away? I got to improve that, Sherry. All right, let's see. Juanita, did I tell you hi to Juanita? Okay, I got to get going. I got to go. I got to watch Marty's Live and Shovel Snow. But guys, I love every one of you. If you have a birthday today, happy birthday. I just did some shout outs on my Facebook to some birthdays in this family. Remember this, guys. All these products that we've been talking about are all connected through AI. So it's not like you got to open the close. The it's all there. All there. Just O staff and O academy. Wait till you got O connect coming. If you go in the back office, you see what's coming next. O tracker. Um, I'm thinking that should be out next week, but I don't know 100%. But wait for the old Ash Meister to come down and tell us the rules. He's been extremely busy. Plus, he's probably getting pounded with snow in Boston, Boston, like we are. So hang tight. I know you all got that ash phobia. God, if I don't see ash in five minutes, y'all go crazy. Don't get crazy. He's working for you. He's working for you nonstop. Trust me. I know this. How do I know? Because I'm really plugged in uh, with ash and what, what's going on. But just be ready. Uh, we'll see you again or Saturday at 11 o'clock is the uh, the public guest Tuesdays and Saturdays at 11 o'clock a.m. You have Red Redford, Marty DeGarmo. Uh, I think Andy's going to be on there, Mike Ellis, Dan Street, uh, all kind of people. Sometimes Julie, sometimes Marina. Everyone is on this one for guests only. Really cool cool thing to get on. And then Julie and Milo uh, will be at, oh boy, what time is Julie and Milo on Saturday? Six? Hold on. I'm thinking, oh. Two o'clock, I'm sorry. Two o'clock, Julie Milo will be talking to churches, pastors, and what it can do. Hey, listen, all you churches out there that are struggling right now, okay? And I know you are because of attendance, because of the weather, the viruses. This is a great thing. If you got one of those food pantries, guys, one position is going to feed a whole lot of people right from your church. Think about that. All right, I got to get going. I'm talking way too much. Did I miss anybody? I hope not. Let me see. Arif, how you doing? Yep, Julie, I remember, and my, my mind went blank. Oliver, what's happening, buddy? <laughs> Marie Sosa, what's happening? Or, excuse me, Mario Sosa, how you doing, brother? Uh, if I'm missing you. Tracy Richards, there you are. Uh, Julie's talking about the uh, pastors in there, reading on that. Read the comments. Not only guitars, but anything in wood. Yeah, Bill is a master carpenter. Actually, Bill's a... Bill does a lot of things. He's a very, very creative guy. He can build just about anything. Uh, secure, how you doing? All right, I got to get going. Remember about those prayers, guys. Remember about Viviana Rodriguez. Uh, get back, Viviana Rodriguez, excuse me, get back with her. Uh, that's, a, that's a pretty big old bless. I've dealt with it. And 
uh, like I said, I'm I'm glad that I went through it, but it, I tell you what, it was very, very stressful, not just on me and my daughter, but my mom also. It's great to keep family together, especially when they're sick, so remember that. All right, I got to go. I love every one of you. Marty's going to be on in six minutes. Go show him some love. Check out Red Red for He did a live earlier. I think he did it at 12. A pretty good praying for UK uh, that those winds stop. Check out that video I posted on them. And let's just do this. Ron and Lynn tonight, 8 o'clock. All right, that link will be posted everywhere. Get in it. I got to go. I love every one of you. See ya.